how's everybody doing today? My name is Cindy and this is Emma and we're with Nana Sews and More. Don't mind the doggies in the background. Um, when you start opening windows up, they tend to bark a little more than normal, which you've heard before. Okay, um, let me let me take a second. This is Liam. Come here, Liam. Come back here. Come stand right here with Nana. Come here. Come back here. Way back here. Look at the camera. See you? No. Wave. Wave. Say hi to everybody. Okay. Let me let me do what I gotta do real quick. Now that we're on. The part that when I watch everybody, this part kind of annoys me. Because you feel like, come on. They're doing puzzles and coloring on the table. Not me. I'm only doing puzzling. You're only doing puzzling? Okay. Nina, do you want me to tilt it down to this stuff? Okay. What I know to do. Do I what? Okay. Tilt it down to this. In one second. Alrighty. So, what we're going to do is nah, nah, I'm going nah, to share. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, yeah, Nina. I figured out it's nah, easier nah, 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 instead of pushing nah, it this nah, way, nah, like this. It's easier to hold it like this and push. Nana, okay. Nana, 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 Yes? Can you help me to Okay, one second. I have Lee on my grandson today, so it might be a little bit noisier. More noisier than normal. Nana. Yes. I figured out it's easier instead of doing this to push it, it's easier to do. Oh, we'll wait until they're saying, can you kind of pop in for us so we're not going to talk to everybody? You can see everybody in the background. There, doing some stuff on the table. You dropped it, You dropped it, Emma. What? You dropped it on the floor. Can you, can you throw it in the trash, please? Okay. Thank you. Ew. <laughs> Nana, he thinks that this zucchini it fell on the floor and he thinks it's a worm. Where did you put the piece that fell on the floor? Yeah, it's it's oh, okay. I was going to say, don't put it on it's the plate. No. Why would I put it on the plate? Throw it in the trash, Liam. It's food. It's a worm. No, it's, it's food. You throw food. making cauliflower fried rice. Oh, I didn't know what it was. Yes. <laughs> so, um, we, Emma has already yeah. started sprouting. Thank you, but you can leave it on the table, okay? Um, Emma has already started sprouting the noodles, or the zucchini, so we have one left. We're trying to do as much prep work as we can, as possible. Hi, Rachel. So, I have to take this. Give me one second. Emma, tell them what you're doing. I am spiraling the zucchini with our spiraler. So, first, you want to cut off the ends. Can you no, you can't even walk. Can you walk? Look, it's walking. It's skinny walking. Okay, sorry, that was an important phone call that 
learning take. Okay, she's going to show you that, what she's doing. And then right here, there are spikes, and you want to stick your zucchini to them. Did you show this piece? Show, hold on one second. Oh, no, I didn't. There's, um, it comes with several pieces, and you can see there's like a little round circle on this one. Um, you can get these almost anywhere. This one in particular I got from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, but I'm sure Walmart or anybody else will have them. So these spikes right here, you want to stick your zucchini to them. And then you're going to smush it up against the... Okay. Yeah, like the circle thing. And it has a... Um, let me just, we'll take it off. It has a little piece right here to help it suction down to the counter so it's not moving all over. But that gives you an idea of how it how it looks on there. And we just have a paper plate right there catching them as they fall. And then you just want to twist it and hold it right here and then spin it. And then it starts spiraling. This one, the center keeps breaking. Help! That's okay. here is I have four tablespoons of butter in my pan and I'm going to add garlic but I wanted to show you minced garlic. Now I do my garlic. Excuse me. I need to get the mincer out. Somebody might not have seen. I don't know. So I take, let me put it down. I take my garlic and it's not peeled yet. Whoops. Not peeled. Oh, got butter fingers. It's not peeled yet. Oh, I know, Rachel. I heard you want some. And I take and I put the flat piece of the knife down on here. And I slam the knife down. And look at this. The, this just comes right off this outside edge. So you're not sitting there trying to um, to peel. Do it again. Maybe I can come closer and you can watch. Maybe this bowl over here. 
Tilt down. Okay, can you see what I'm doing? Got it there. The flat edge of the knife laying on it. Smash down. It smashes it. And then, like I said, the outer edge just literally peels right off. Hold on, I got one more. Ready? one now I know I've showed this on here before but for those of you who may not seen this this little gadget I don't know where but my mother-in-law got this for me a long time ago it's got little teeth inside it on the lid too and then you close it and then you just spin it and it'll crush it up person. I don't care for my food. Um, let me turn that down a little bit. To be hot. Like spicy hot. And nobody else. I, I have a few people in the house that like it that way. There's two. I mean, if it's a tiny bit, it's okay. But I, I don't like a lot of it. should have used the dehydrated ones. They would have went much, much faster. And by the way, my spiral, I got it with my 20% off coupon from Bed Bath & Beyond. And they, so that helped bring the price of it down some. shrimp here. I just bought um, frozen shrimp and we took the tails off already. We've already done that. We got a couple pounds here. You can see here is all of our shrimp. Already done. Yeah, give it a little bit of stir. That's, we're going to cook it for about three minutes. Yeah, hold the candle. She's stirring that. I'm going to get two cups of, actually, I need like four cups of, uh, somewhere between two to four cups of uh, chicken stock. I'll have to see how it looks when I add the two in. I might do three. Oh, excuse me. That was like way off. It was a quarter cup. quarter cup and you pour it in two cups? Yeah. I want approximately a cup. Look! Me and Liam traded. You want to try doing it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I
keep stirring it. You just want to kind of let it cook. Our shrimp is cooking. I don't know how long it's been cooking for. I wasn't paying attention. Can I get a Yoo-Hoo? Let me see. Nana. Nana. Mm -hmm. Needs a few more minutes. Nana. Nana. Go to her. Nana. Mm -hmm. Can I get a Yoo-Hoo? Yes. Okay, thank you. I was announcing for you. I, I already asked. Okay. Well, that's cooking. Let me show you our wreath. Because remember, we're going to have a contest. It's not done, but it is a work in progress. That's how it's looking so far. I think it needs more color. Somebody asked why I didn't have yellow, and it was because the store didn't have the yellow. So I might have to go to a different store or go and see if they got more in stock because they were having a huge sale, so a lot of it was going. Honey, your mommy's right there. No, I want to tell you something. What? Come here. If it has to do with the you, go talk to your mommy. No, the you. She wants wants to show you how she gets it out when she can't. Okay, go ahead. I, I'm watching you from here. Okay, well, dump it out. Okay. Because they're all at the So bottom. the shrimp looks to me to be ready. So and now I'm going to add... Let start out with a quarter cup. So you can put see what we get. Them in the fridge. Okay? Put them in the Not fridge. a little bit more, because we want it to cook no, down. Put them in the box. Yes. Yeah, in the box. And you're supposed to use juice of a le one lemon. Well, I don't have any lemons, so I have lemon juice, so I'm just going to guess. Lou, you want to use them? I'm going to bite it. That's probably about as much as you can get from a lemon. I'm going to give that Let a stir. This second. is all the zucchini that we got. Yeah, that's from quite a few. I think we're going to change the pan that we're cooking in. Because once we add that zucchini. Well, Emma, I'm going to need your help, please. Okay. And I have this here. It's chicken and seafood. Um, I think I got it at... Um, Oh, what is that place called? BJ's. It's just the seasoning. I'm going to add a little bit of this seasoning to it. It's a seafood seasoning, actually. It's a tiny bit, not much. There's only two left, you know why? Why? Because my mom wanted one. Okay. We don't normally have you who in the house, so they're excited over the yoo-hoo's. All right, I'm, I'm going to lift this up, and if you could help pour the, get this into the pan, please, I would greatly appreciate that. Let me the pan. Here, take the spoon. Oh. My tummy hot. Okay. Kaylin, you can do both of them. No, I don't want your puzzle. There we go. 
one are, are you putting in the zucchini? In a few minutes. I need to add some basil. Absolutely love. It calls for fresh basil at the end, but I got this. But I love these. It's like, um, that's parsley. I meant parsley. I'm sorry. Um, I'm not to say either. You have the wrong one or you said the wrong one. See, it's like a, um, like a paste. It looks good. Candy, hi, how are you? If you're just joining us, we're making a very healthy dinner for tonight. I'm trying to get my dinner done early. And I can um, do my workout and don't have to worry about dinner. This is a very long noodle. Yeah. Um, so we're making uh, shrimp scampi with um, parsley. Do you like my this is one noodle. That's one noodle? Mm-hmm. Okay. All righty. Now, let's add our noodles. Your hands are clean, right? Yes. Okay, so just pick it up and put it in. I'll tell you when to stop, because we can save those noodles for another day if we need to. All right, wait, 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 put about half of that in. Because we can make something else with these noodles. There we go. We just finished the noodle that was already Okay. Made. You know what would work good? <laughs> this is my, um, look at this thing, it's for spaghetti. It's stained, it's not dirty. So then we can, so that the noodles can cook down. You know what? We're, I think we might need the rest of those noodles. We do? Yeah, go ahead. Okay, hold off. Let's stop there. Let these cook down so a little bit. Gonna... Okay, we're going to save the rest of the noodles because I think that might be cheap. just a handful. Yeah, I see that. Okay. Wish I could get my hand in there without burning it and, and turn this stuff. Thank you for sharing for those of you that have shared. Are you sure that's one of it? Okay, can you um, just go ahead and add them in there? No. It's not a big deal. Mm -hmm. I Grab a lid. That's too big. That's a little bit too No. Emma, Emma! Do you know how to do this part, Emma? Do you want to do part? Do you want to do this one now? No. Oh, Went to it, fell down behind. Okay. I'm thinking maybe if I, um, put a lid on this, let it kind of cook down a little bit. Let me turn that down. So while that is cooking, simmering up, let me turn, put it on the other, other burner. Yes, we're going to make our, ch uh, right now, we just finished our, hi Sandy. We just Hi. finished our cauliflower, or I'm mean, sorry, our um, shrimp scampi with zucchini noodles. And now we're going to make our cauliflower fried rice. I've never made this recipe before. I bought this at um, Walmart, made by Green Giant. And it is, it actually says cauliflower crumbles fried rice blend. And it says it has, um, I see Why carrots in like it. This? Sorry, guys. Well, it's not real rice. But it has, let's see, cauliflower in it, um, broccoli, carrots, onions. Um, what? <laughs> onions. I just don't want some people to hear that. Then they won't they'll automatically not want to eat it because they heard that word. Well, I don't like cauliflower, so. But this is going to be like eating fried rice. You'll never know the difference. I've had okay. it before. So what this is going to tell me to do is... I've never made it before. But I've had cauliflower fried rice before. In a medium skillet, heat one tablespoon of oil over medium heat. So let's go ahead and do that. Thanks for sharing. 
Might be a little bit more oil than I need it, but we'll be okay. How's this looking in here? Okay. You wanna um see about giving that a, a stir? Because we want these noodles to soften, but I don't want to overcook my uh sure. shrimp. I'm trying to get the shrimp kind of up. You wanna do that? Maybe turn let's turn this down. Oops, I had it on too high. Different burner, different sides, different whatever. Alrighty. And this calls for garlic also. Three garlic cloves, finely chopped. Get some more of our garlic out and do it again. Let me get our garlic press. I do have an actual garlic press. I don't even know if I've ever used it because I have this and I love this. Oops. No, 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 don't eat that. Don't eat that, don't eat that. I believe garlic is very dangerous for dogs. All right, how's that? Okay. I got a lot of the shrimp on top. Okay, good. You can put the lid back on it and just let it simmer Where's a little. Over here. It's not hot. Mm. Can I do that thing again? Sure. Sandy, if you didn't see earlier, um, hi, Sister Alton. She's with us also. Hi. For those of you who didn't see earlier for my um, uh, garlic, you take a piece of garlic, you take your knife and the flat edge and you lay it down on it, smash it with your palm of your hand. Ooh, that one really smashed a little bit more than I would like. And see how the, um, the outer edge just comes right off. the covering that you don't want. Go on. And then let Emma show you how she does that. So, so that on the inside it has teeth. Huh? So that it has teeth on the inside. Yeah. Okay, because there's new ones that join. It has teeth on the lid and the inside and you close it. And then you just move it back and forth. To crush the garlic. Okay. How is it? Is that good? Perfect. No show. And then this is what it looks like after you crush it all. So, for those of you who just joined us, we um, have over here in the bigger pan. We have shrimp scampi with zucchini zucchini needles, and now I'm going to make cauliflower fried rice. Okay. We're making dinner early tonight because I want to be able to go work out in just a little bit. So all we have to do is come back and heat it up and eat. Because, you know, the best time to eat is after you work out because that's when all your calories are being burnt the best. There you go, Emmy. Said add the garlic. I'm trying to read on this bag for one to two minutes. It's kind of hard to read. I mean, look how the writing blends right on in with the stuff inside it. Like I said, I saw this at Walmart the other day, and I thought, hmm. And then today, this is still too high. It's browning too much. Um, I was in my refrigerator, and I'm like, oh, that expires tomorrow. I better cook it. Since I don't know what I'm having for dinner tomorrow night yet. Figure what better time than today. Okay, then after you cook that, you're going to add this. Cauliflower. It's, again, it's cauliflower, um, carrots, broccoli, and it says onions. to read in the wrong directions. Okay, because you can cook this in the microwave. I need a scrap piece of paper. I cannot read that. I need to put something white behind it, so I'm going to take a paper towel. 
There, much better. Now I can read it. Okay, it says cook it about five to seven minutes. Poison sauce. Give it a check and see how it's going. We could probably even turn it off because that burner stays hot. Let me get out a tablespoon. I need a tablespoon. What do you want to Just Turn it upside down. And sit it there. Yes, babe. He's loving doing his puzzle over there. It also called for garlic salt. Uh, this looks really good. Let's go about that. Seems like an awful lot of garlic, but we'll go for it. Oh, pick it up, honey. Does. Okay, I think that's perfect. So why don't you just let it sit a little bit? Let's see how the well, actually, let's see how the noodles are tasting. I might have overcooked them a little. She's gonna try. Oh, you, I thought you were getting it out for you to try. Let me see. Well, I was letting it cool off. Pretty good, actually. Well, not too bad. Okay, just put the lid on it so it stays warm while we're cooking this. About three more minutes. In the meantime, I'm going to take an egg and I'm going to beat an egg. Veggies are softened, so let me see. Oh, no. Carrots aren't even close to being softened. Probably should put a lid on it. Is it done? I mean, no, it doesn't taste good. And this is good? Mm hmm That's perfect. I'll take the lid from that. Hi, Gigi. Oh, hi, Mom. My mom is watching. I have my mama Elton and my mama mama. What do you want this to stay warm? It'll be all right. It's a little watery because I really probably should have um, squeezed out the juice. the juice from the zucchini, but I wasn't sure, so I figured I'd give it a try. I didn't know how much liquid I actually need it. Go ahead. I'm just going to give it a try. 
Oh, you want another one? See, it's good. She's trying another one. Yeah, they are hot. I have a plate. Oh. I can get some in oh, she's it. getting everything. Well, I want shrimp in it too. There. Let it cool down first. What time is dinner? Well, it'll be done in a few minutes. Are you ready for dinner? Is that what you're telling me? That's my timer. It says that this should, uh, looks like I might be making some house calls. Thank you for sharing. Oh. I don't know why that, uh, corn doesn't seem to be cooking up. I'm going to put just a little bit more oil in there. It might help. Emma says it's really good. Good, I'm glad. I'm gonna have to drain some of this oil, up, this juice out. It's just way too much. Oh, let me shut that. across the street. Who knew that could be so loud? Okay, so this is pretty much ready now. So it tells you to stir an egg in. Now, I've never, ever made uh, fried rice, stir fried rice before. So this is going to be interesting, but I've watched them do it. I'm going to just wait for the egg to cook. It says, um, Cook two to three minutes until the egg is cooked. Why did you make this one tonight? I'm not going to be here. You can take a little bit with you. She's upset because she won't be here for dinner tonight. But I think she's um, taking care of that situation right now. <laughs> what do you think? Yes. Sister Outen's hungry, Emma. Oh, I can see the egg in there cooking. Can we see this? I wonder if I turn the light out if it'll be better. Does that look better? No. Yes. Yeah. There we go. Oh, yeah, the egg is pretty much I cooked. think it would be better with, I think it tastes better with the juice in it. Oh, you want Because I had a piece without it, without mm -hmm. barely any one, and then one with, with some. Yeah, but that's way too, well, it might absorb in it too. Okay, so the egg is cooked now, and it tells you to add two teaspoons of soy sauce. I'm sorry, tablespoons. Okay. Let me give that a stir. You're doing a good job, Liam. Yeah, yeah. So what is everybody else having for dinner tonight? Apparently I have some company coming or I'll be making some uh, house calls. Huh? Sister out and went some. Nana. What, well, honey? Okay. Mama. Now, I don't know what this tastes like. I've never had it. I've Mama. read about it. What? But I've never had it, so let's see. It smells okay. I'm coming. And it calls for one tablespoon of this. Let's see what this tastes like. Here, Oh, it's actually pretty good. You should do this one, please. Please, please. Please do this one. I was worried that it might be hot or something. And it also calls for green onions. Number one, I don't have them. 
Um, and number two, I didn't have a lot of family members that don't like them. Though, if I did have them, they would be going in here. They'd have to, to pick. How is this looking? Is this looking good? are for garnishing anyway but still I would probably just go ahead and mix them in so Emma took my plate that I was going to use so I'm going to have to slide these over a little bit to get a new plate out so we can plate everything up and see how it tastes This is what I'm excited to try, this um, cauliflower rice. I know it's probably a strange combination What's for dinner. Rice? The fried rice and the um, scampi. I have an Italian end. Uh, Chinese. <laughs> what I say, just eat what you like. Excuse me. Yeah, she's over here just eating away. I don't know if you all can see her. See how it tastes? No, that like doesn't matter. Okay, now here's the shrimp and zucchini. Let me get some shrimp by, or zucchini by itself. Let's put it on a little mushy. Cook it too long. Yeah, it's too much liquid. Now try the cauliflower fried rice. Mmm. Emma. Try it. Do you like fried rice? See, told you. You can't taste the onion, can you? Emma. What do you think? Emma. Eh. 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 I like it. It's not yeah. good, but it's not bad. You want to try a bite? No. Yeah, try a bite. Yummy. Please? Well, mmm. Mmm. Is it good? Give me thumbs up if it's good. Mm -hmm. I see you did the puzzle. Liam. Is it good? Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Good? Mm-hmm. You want more? Yeah. Told you it was good. Don't listen to Emma. She likes the cauliflower fried rice. So there we have it. Dinner is all ready for after my workout, and it's good, and it's healthy. Do you deliver? It looks so good. I might have to deliver to you. Let me see how my night goes. Maybe I'm going to get ready to run out the door if I have enough time. Mm. Oh, he needs more. What's that tell you? Here you go, another bite. <laughs> Emma, or here, I'm going to come try a bite of shrimp. No! I made shrimp, your favorite. No, Nana, SpongeBob SquarePants is on. Mom is in there, right? Yeah, but we can't find the remote. It's on top of the TV. Here, come have a bite of shrimp. No, while you Okay. She normally loves shrimp, but she won't love There's something in your ear? Yes. You never know what kids are going to say or do. Okay. Well, that is it.
We want to thank you for joining. And I'll see what I can do about getting some over to you. Mama, I'm going to go home, Mama. And Liam wants some more, so i got to make Liam a plate. All right, well, we want to thank you for joining us. We're so glad to have everybody here today. Thank you for sharing. And for those of you who did not see earlier, let me show you again. The wreath is almost done. I'm going to put some ribbon, maybe some flowers or something in it. It needs just a little bit more color. So that's what's going to, we're going to be giving away. We just need nine more to follow us, and that will be our giveaway. Right, Em? So, okay, I just haven't had a chance to that. Yes, babe? She, he needs more food, so. All right, let me go feed him. Thank you for joining us. I'm Cindy. This is Emma. And we're with Nana Sews and More. And everybody have a good evening. Thanks, Candy. It was pretty good. So I hope everybody gives it a try. If you give it a try, come back and leave me a message and tell me what you thought. Um, I'm going to pin the shrimp scampi recipe that I, well, I don't know, because I didn't really follow it. I kind of did my own thing. But I'll pin it, and then you can change it and do your own thing if you'd like. All right, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye.